Welcome to QuestionInfo.co.uk, Get Going Guides with our WordPress tutorials. Uh, this uh, tutorial we're looking at widgets and plugins uh, for your uh, website. Widgets add some little bits of functionality and interactivity to your site uh, which can be quite uh, good for you. And widgets are found on this right hand side over here so we've got search information, recent posts and categories uh, all listed uh, there. Now to add and control these we just go to widgets or we go to the appearance and down to widgets and these are the things we've got running in our uh, sidebar so if you want you can click on these and up will come information so in recent posts how many posts do you want to do and what do you want to call it so I'm just going to change it to my posts and make a save on that and then go uh, to visit the site and you'll see that it's now changed it to my posts and will show uh, a number of posts there. Now if we go back to the widget things, if there's something we don't want, so we don't want to show the categories anymore, you can just drag it off and get rid of it and we don't want the archives, that's okay, but if there's something we want to add, we're going to add a calendar, we want to go there and I'll call that my cow uh, for there and then I can view it again and I can see what we've got there and you can see that I've got a calendar appeared on my uh, sidebar. Now I can change the order of those just by quickly going up and changing the order and it will appear on the site in that space as well so I've got the calendar appearing higher up now. Now you can add more widgets uh, quite easily but you go to a thing called plugins. Plugins it shows you what plugins you've got running already so these are ones that need to be activated just click activate when you want it this one's very good because it stops people spamming your site uh, and stops it being hacked so it's a little bit of security for it you do need to go to click on these links and they will give you a key which you type into your uh, server and it will then start to work for you um, we're going to install a new one so we just go add new and then you can put keywords in for it uh, there. So you can just click on widget, we've got a little floating tag cloud there but I know if I do mad it comes up with the one uh, that I want and I'm going to install a Google um, AdSense for you. It's got this little AdSense widget that's good and to install it you just click install now. Yes I'm sure I want to install it. It will download it to your server and I just want to activate it uh, straight away and there it is so you can see here I've got it uh, running here I can deactivate at any point uh, but it does have some setting up information uh, to do which means I've got to go to Google to join in my account now give you a little bit of code that you would need to paste into it uh, at a, a later stage but we won't do that we're just in up with blank adverts at the moment so now if I go to my widgets you should see my easy um, AdSense light appeared and so I'm going to drag that into the sidebar. I haven't done the settings bit. Uh, you can just follow your nose uh, for that. So you just go back there and sort it out from there. But uh, So I can change where it is. But now let's see what it's done. If I scroll down, you can see I've got this box that has appeared on my page, which is where an advert will appear. So each post will have an advert if I want it. Uh, there's not an advert appearing there because I've got to put the plugin uh, ad code into there. So you can add your own widgets, you just go searching around. You can go to wordpress.org and you can find loads of uh, widgets and stuff there to play in, or plugins uh, as they would call them, um, and just play around with them and find the ones that work for you. There's all sorts of different things uh, out there, there's thousands of them uh, for you to play with. Easy to install, easy to uninstall doesn't matter if it goes wrong, you can just get rid of it at a later date. So this is www.chrislinfordco.uk. You can find me on iTunes and YouTube, and I'll see you again for another tutorial.